Red Bull just released their newest winter edition. YouTube, welcome back to the channel. The newest winter edition of Red Bull is out. It is the pear cinnamon flavor. So we'll try this out and see how it tastes. See if it's something you should be picking up in the stores. Last year's winter edition was Fig Apple. Um, if you wanna see the review on that one, I'll leave a link to that video. I don't remember if I like this one or not. I know I never bought it again. And the previous year to this, a 2021 winter edition was pomegranate. I don't know about prior to that because I was trying to find a list online. Is there a list of different uh, winter editions? I couldn't find it. If you know, if you have the list of what the US versions, how far back it goes, leave it down in the comments. I would love to know that information. But we're here for the pear cinnamon. I don't know. I, it's just not a, some of these flavors they're doing are a little weird. It's not something I would think of. Obviously cinnamon for the holidays makes sense. Pear, I don't know. I've never had pears with cinnamon on it. Could be good, we'll find out. All right, so these are the 8.4 ounce cans or 250 milliliters, uh, 110 calories in here. And these have 80 milligrams of caffeine. Not picking up much of a way of smell. I assume this is probably a clear, well, it's the, you know, the Red Bull color, kind of a goldish tint to it. Now in the glass, picking up more of the, the cinnamon smell to it. All right, the pear cinnamon Red Bull. Hmm, at least from the first initial response to it, I get more pear. Like the cinnamon, at least from that drink, isn't too much. That's what I was wondering, man, if it's, you know, cinnamon flavored drink, sometimes it can be a little overpowering. It's almost more pear. I don't think I picked up much cinnamon at all. Let me have a little more. The cinnamon is there. It's really, really slight. If I had to go a ratio, I would say maybe 80% pear, 20% cinnamon in here. It's actually nice. Because again, if it's too much cinnamon, it just, you know, it's, I think it would almost be like drinking, uh, what am I thinking of? Potpourri, kinda. That, that's what I was thinking. This could be like tasting like potpourri. Not that I drink potpourri, but I can imagine what potpourri, the water in the bottom of a thing of potpourri would taste like. That's what I was thinking. This is, this is pretty good, actually. Let me try it out of the can. See if there's any taste, different taste. Maybe I pick up more cinnamon here. Yeah, it's, man, definitely. I Like I said, I don't remember. I could chill this and dry it because it's still unopened, but I'd have to go back and check the review. Let me take my glasses off here. Um. Yeah, I don't remember. I'd have to check the video on this if I enjoyed this one or not. Like I said, I'll leave a link to that one. This is good. This is... Man. Off a of recollection from going from what I... I don't, I don't think I was a big fan of the pomegranate either. This is definitely, I think, my top winter edition. And as far as Red Bull flavors in general, this is definitely up there in the top. I'm trying to think what would, it's been a while, some of these ones that only come out every once in a while, but this is definitely a top five flavor for me. Again, I'm pleasantly surprised because they didn't have, like I went to Target, which then I went to Meyer here in the Midwest, we have Meyer too. Meyer had it in singles, but I had already went to Target because I looked up online to see who had it out. And Target said, oh, we have it available. No other stores said it, so. And Target didn't have it in individuals. I had to get the four pack. And I was like, ah, wasn't happy about it because I was like, I'm only gonna drink one of these. I don't think I'm, I wasn't expecting I was gonna like this at all, which I do. Now I'm glad I have a four pack because I will definitely have another one. Not right now, but, and I may buy these again. These are really good. Mmm. 
You see, that, that combination of the pear and cinnamon works perfectly. Not too much cinnamon. The pear, you might be like, ah, I don't know. I'm not a big fan of pears. It's me neither. I mean, I'll eat pears. I mean, honestly, I don't know the last time I ever had a pear. Oh, you back? He's not thrilled sometimes on the drink ones. You can't have this. I know there's no food here. Um, but I've had pears as a kid and they're okay. This isn't, I don't know, it's not too pear-y. It's definitely not too cinnamony. It's a perfect mix. If you're in the store and you're unsure, just pick up the, the one can, the, the 8.4 ounce can and try it. I think you'll like it. Definitely leave it down in the comments below. Let me know what you think of it. Out of 10, I finished this. I'm definitely gonna finish this, which I don't need to because I just had a G Fuel. So this is gonna be a lot of caffeine. I'm gonna be bouncing off the wall. Probably not even gonna edit this video because it'd be like, but this is really good. I'm gonna give it an 8.5. No, that's a little, I'm gonna go nine, nine. I enjoy this one. Like I've said, I don't buy Red Bulls other than for reviews. Like if I go to the store, I don't typically pick up a Red Bull. I'm not, I don't enjoy the flavors that much, but this is one where I think I would definitely pick it up again. There you go. I'm gonna give it a nine. The pear cinnamon, it's really good. Highly suggest picking it up, trying it out. At least give it a smell. What do you think? I know it doesn't have that strong of a smell. You wanna check out the can? There you go. Pear cinnamon, winter edition, only out for a limited time. So definitely get it while you can. It's a really good one. Like I said, I'll leave a link to the other video if you want to check out the Fig Apple. I don't think you'll find these in the stores anymore. Maybe you can pick them up on eBay. I don't know how good they would be. What's the expiration on this? June 2023, so it's only a few months old, so it'd probably still be okay. You could drink it. There you go. If you enjoyed the video, smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already subscribed. I'll see you in the next video.